Hey guys, welcome to The Bunker. It's a game that I've been super stoked about this entire month since I, came, since I knew it came out. And uh, let's go play it. Yeah, yeah, so excited. It's like, um, it's like a point and click, but they use actual actors and actual footage. And it's like a movie. So here we go. Super excited. Explosion and screams. It's a boy. Well done. Breathe. Ah, so that was me. So you can let the baby die. Ah, scratched my arm again. Government and military personnel. They're probably gonna explain, but it's about a dude who's living in the bunker all by himself. And it's that boy that was just born 30 years later. So he's 30 now. Day 10,998. Okay, this is me. Where's the dude? Where can I click on? Oh, okay. I guess it'll tell me when I need to click. It'll explain. That's blood there. Is that the generator? Oh, that's probably the last one then. You've got to say it again, John. You'll probably be alone, Mom. No. And the main dude is uh, oh, also one of the hobbits in the... Uh, one of the dwarves in the hobbit. As long as I stick to the routine, I'll be safe. As long as I always be here. Stay in our rooms, I'll be safe. As long as I don't go outside, I'll be safe. That's it. Good boy. <laughs> <laughs> what do we miss it? Bleeding time, Mum. Yes. Can I choose which book? The Bible, Domestic Nuclear Shelters, or Treasure Island? <laughs> he was consumed by the time. <laughs> Behind another trunk. I think my two watch. Mum. Phew, that sounds horrible. Be here. I keep you safe, I promise. No. 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 Please. Aww. 
That's sad. That was two to three achievements right there, just looking at the intro. <laughs> Here we are. He has such a good face. Okay. Routine. Day 11. 109. Okay. Medical vitamins. So I just gotta go through the list, right? This is so fucking cool. Uh, but what do I take? This one? I need to take my vitamins first. Vitamins. Okay. Vitamins. How about this one then? How cool is it to work on a project like this? They have to think about, well, not really, but they have to, like, film every outcome that they want you to be able to do. Okay, I have to hold that. Radiation is just over 70 MR. That's acceptable. Okay. Is that how you check radi radiation with a thing like that? Oh, I wanted to click that. Come here. Okay, radio. So he's sticking to this routine every day. I would go bonkers. I would just go outside. Especially if I'm the last one. Just fuck it. Who cares? I don't think there's anything there. Such a cool actor they got for this. Kuchuk! Radiation check. How do you check that? Didn't you just do that? Regional government, HQ. Okay. System okay, time in bunker, 1109 days. One survivor. Perform bunker radiation check. Temperature okay, boiler, server, water, communications, everything is working. Wow. Bunker radiation is normal. That's good. good. After that many days? Kuchink. Food. How much is there? Oh, mother. Oh, that's on your checklist. Oh, no. Hmm. I need to choose dinner. Wait, why is it in the bathroom? That's disgusting. And it, people use it as well. Why is there food? I I have really beans. I really have a thing against. So that makes twenty-seven years, three months, and fourteen days of food left. Ah, oh, dude, no, that's like, I really can't deal with this. Like eating something and being in the in the same room with a bathroom just makes me sick. I don't know why, but it's just disgusting. Especially if you think that like food, like from turds and piss and everything like the it goes into the oxygen like the filth is in the air and you're breathing it already and then you're eating something with it gross mother how's your mother doing oh shit she's still there that's gross dude you have to get rid of her they must have furnaces or something what have they done with the other 58 bodies, or how many were, was it? The drawing I did for Mum. When? Not last week, I hope. That's creepy! What happened to her eyes? That's fucking creepy. I really hope for you that she's not getting up. What shall I read to Mum? You're gonna read to her? Okay, do this one then. The 
van should be set in operation as soon as the shelter is occupied and the outside doors closed. It should be closed down immediately following the attack to prevent the filters blocking due to the air following the blast wave being contaminated with dust particles both from the ground and from any falling buildings. These particles will not be re radioactive. Similarly, the ventilation should be shut down when the fallout is expected. Jesus Christ, this is good. Good drink. Why are you reading to your dead mother though? Jesus Christ, okay. Okay, that's creepy. Next day. Okay, so at some point something creepy is gonna happen. Oh, I don't have to click it anymore, okay. You wanna? Yeah. Oh, it's higher. Radiation is nearly ATMR. It's increasing. Oh shit. Ka chink ka chink Radio. Maybe we can hear something now. You must be losing your mind, dude. A person can't be alone for that long. I'm gonna read your mom. Read to your mom. Don't eat beans on the toilet again, please. That's true horror right there. No, don't. Seven years, three months. And 13 days left. Gross. That's gross. Don't. Don't eat while you're on the toilet. Oh, your mom's gonna look like shit in a couple days, dude. She must smell so bad. We had a dreary morning's work before us. But there were no sign of any wind. And the boats had gone out and land. Dude. The ship wrapped three or four miles around the corner. Take of the care of your mom. Around the narrow passages to the haven behind Skeleton Island. Please. I volunteered for one of the boats. Move on. Christ, she's gonna be gone at some point. <sighs> yeah, I was about to say we did both. What do you do in between those things? Like how... Hey, it's Pocky Day. <laughs> In Japan, um, 11th of November is Pocky Day. Um, Pocky is like, it's like a stick, a cookie stick with chocolate on it. So it's like just one straight thing. So if you put four of them together, you have November 11. So one, 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 one. Pocky Day. Let's do it again. Or are they expecting me to click stuff out of order? He's gonna get bored. Radiation is over 80 MR. You're gonna start hallucinating. Yeah. Oh, here we go, guys. What's happening? Server failure. Okay. Is it manual something? Number something. So are we gonna read that? See what we need to do? I'm getting so many achievements. <laughs> Where's the manual? In one of the things? Need new underwear right now. No, I'm looking for your manual. My 
old diary. Today it is my birthday and I have had extra peaches, my favourite, and there was a candle. Mum gave me this book and some pens. Look, here are the colours. <laughs> Vera sang me a ring of ring of roses. She said she was crying because she was happy it's my birthday. And then she and PJ and Louie and Mum sang me happy birthday, but not too loud. I blew out the candle. This book is going to be my book about my friends. Aww. Today I will start a new friend. He will look like this. He will be a soldier because I have a general, but I need a bigger army. Your friends are your puppets. I got a block from the map room, but I had to hide. Mr. Bishop was there. He nearly saw me. He was shouting. He says I am a waste. I think he is a waste. I will make the soldier and Mr. Churchill and Joan of Arc. Joan of Arc. Fight Mr. Bishop. Oh, Fark. Okay. So that today. that's his friends right there. Sticky. It is better than sardines, which are the worst. Mum has made my knife sharper so I can finish off doing my soldier. She says Rocky was the best at winning fights, so that's his name. <laughs> I finished Rocky, so here are all my friends. Oh no, it's not like... Okay, so it's not the friends' names. What happened to the commissioner? Okay. So not there, maybe in the bottom one? Ah, there we go. In events of server failure, make announcements Make an announcement that main power is being shut down for maintenance. Find fuse box located in storage room, level 2. Identify damaged fuses. Okay, so we need to go... Do I need to write this down? Locate replacement fuses. Shut off main power. Wait 10 seconds. Replace damaged fuse. Switch main power back on. Perform a system check. Okay, so find the fuse box located in the storage room, level 2. Storage room, level 2. Okay. Find the fuse box, level 2. Find the fuse box, level two. <laughs> Taking a friend with you? Mum. Uh, took me ages to make the arms. Okay. I'm not sure I can do this. Don't need to change. Okay. How can I need to find the fuse box on level two? Yes, let's go there. Do we need a flashlight or something? If you have anything like that. Okay. What's this? Okay. <laughs> He's so scared of leaving his routine. You have to do this, dude. You can do it. Do I need to do anything? Come on, dude. You can do it. It's just a door. It's locked. Okay. I need to find the key. Go there. It's so creepy how they filmed him standing everywhere. Room one. Oh, it's your mom's room. Okay, but maybe she has the key. Uh, I don't want to be here. Your mom's creepy, dude. She's dead. Just so you know. That's a key. The key. Now I have to leave. 
jeez, that mom. She's like, don't leave the room, don't leave the room. But that's, uh... It's hindering him now. Some of my old drawings. Hmm. But the soldiers. But so all the soldiers died one by one. Oh, that's it. Okay. Okay, guys. I don't want to look at you, Mom. Not right now. Help me, Mom. She liked it when I read to her. Okay, let's go back. Let's do this. This is so cool. I'm really loving this. I'm so happy that they made something like this now. Like, it's not something of the past. You know how in the 80s and 90s they used to do this kind of stuff? And it kind of died out, so I'm really glad it's getting like such a cool return. I keep thinking Sino would love this. I need to tell him to play this. Oh, he used to be here. And I've taken the spoil supplies off and, and spit it out. Up. 14 months, at best. If we carry on as we are, eight months. But I, I've gone over it with Dr. Hart. On bare minimum, we might make 14. And bare minimum means? I didn't like to press him, but scurvy, rickets, Christ. Ben. Then we all just withered away to skin and bone. <sighs> Maybe I should have just left the hatch open and gone for a nice stroll in the fresh air instead. What do we do? We tell people everything's all right. It's not all right. One whiff of this and you'll have your throat slit over the last tin of peaches. Is that the way you want to die, Sam? fighting over scraps. We could just cut your wrist now and the rest of us will split your rations. Chin up, man. It's ten minutes until the next bulletin. Fighting over scraps. Split your rations. Is the way you want to die, Sam? Oof. Okay. Level two. <gasps> okay, so now we need to get storage. There he goes. The cams are at least still working. You know, I want to go here. Okay. Level two. <laughs> Okay. Wait, are you you or are you super young? You look young. But it must be the current one, right? Oh, that was when there were still lots of people. Cool. That it? Sounds like that's it. Okay. Stuff there, there's stuff there, there's a computer there we can click on. Okay. 
He's actually moving. He's like waiting. They probably looped it perfectly. Communication from Bunker HQ, Site 3, Corsham, Wiltshire. Prime Minister delivered safely before blast hits. 4,013 government ministers and civil servants, including Twat. cabinet office, local and national government agencies, intelligence and security advisors logged in. Shortage noted in domestic support staff. Guess they didn't make Guess it. They didn't make it. Oh, okay, he's saying it. All facilities operating normally. Checks carried out in infirmary, bakery, laundry, kitchens, telephone exchange, storerooms, office space, living accommodation, maintenance areas and workshops. How big is that place? Trust me, you get sent to this sardine tin. Prime Minister unsatisfied with living accommodation. Twat. Twat. <laughs> Other. Civilian casualties noted outside bunker. Group of 50 attempted to breach rear exit blast door. Aggressive action not required. Activity ceased after blast. Oof. Poor bastards. Okay. So that was this one, right? It's a Commodore. It's a regional report. Last contact, 92. Supplies low, fighting. Goodbyes. Rad breach. Okay. Medical reports. 1996, Taylor Vera deceased. Acute gastrointestinal failure. It's going to be fine, okay, so maybe fine is the right word, but we have enough supplies to make it through. Sure of it. If we can just keep it together and be sensible with the rations, then we can make it. Sure, none of us are going to get fat down here, but I could use losing a few pounds anyway. 1996. Things I miss. Uh, level 5. He hates level 5. Okay, I think I got it now. I, I don't know about you guys, but I'm fucking loving this. This is amazing. This is my kind of game. Slash movie. Okay, so there's a door, two doors. A display here. Radiation warning map. This is... We're in the main office right now, right? There's a sick bay on level one. Why is there only two rooms though? Like where did all the other 60 people stay? Level five leads to the exit. Oh, there's an exit here too. Emergency stairwell. Where's the storage uh, on level two? Okay, we'll see. And there's something we can go to there. Let's go door all the way to the right then. Well, let's say for example, the hit on Reading was one megaton. That would mean we have this radius only halfway to Basingstoke. Now maybe that looks small, but that's around 100,000 fatalities. Maybe 80,000 injuries from the blast and the fireball. That's just to start with. Prevailing wind direction here is northeast. Fallout scatter would be huge. How do I save? It's likely to drift all the way out past Cambridge, past Norwich even, out to sea. The total number of casualties- The Netherlands got hit. Unimaginable. And that's one bomb. Yeah. It's pretty bad. Dose in Röntgen's effect on humans. No short term effects from nausea. Nausea and vomiting. Some mortality. Mortality in two to four weeks. Incapacity prolonged for survivors. Heavy mortality. Mortality in one week. Nausea and vomiting immediately. AB welcomes. CB asks clarification purpose of meeting. 
AB puts forward petition from 18 residents keen to institute post of morale officer. It is felt that CB is not forthcoming enough in communicating current status of bunker to residents. CB makes point that any urgent change in status will be communicated very clearly to all residents when it becomes relevant. In his view, no need for a new position. AB cites two safety incidents and asks the committee if they were aware. All but FH, DM, SC are unaware of said incidents. CB says neither incident is cause for immediate concern. No need to raise panic in difficult atmosphere. Calls on FH to clarify incidents. FH agrees not of immediate concern. AB raises point that lack of trust in bunker hierarchy is causing morale issues. More clarity and openness needed. CB reiterates appointed hierarchy and his belief that no need for additional officer. If any critical incident comes to light, all will be made aware. Requests send to meeting as urgent business to attend to. AB calls for vote on appointment of morale officer. CB says vote will be ignored. Not a democracy. <laughs> meeting ended. Okay. Last thing. Oh, press play. Yeah. I just need to know. It's all right, Vera. Nonsense! I know George is trying to hide things from me. I'm in Evelyn. I'm not stupid. Evelyn. I don't know what to say. I suppose he's just not it's sure. Radiation! It... Then why is he trying to hide it? Why? Am I on the right medicine? What can be done? Why won't he say? George has been distracted lately. Maybe he's just trying not to upset everyone. They should be upset. They built this place in six weeks. Six weeks. How can anyone expect it to be safe? There must be a leak. There must be. Ooh, shit. I know what he says. He doesn't want everyone to panic. Silly old Vera having another one of her turn. <coughs> Said Evelyn. It's all of us. Not Margaret. Okay. Okay. That was this room. So I'm gonna cut. Oh wait, there's something here. Top hey, I found a thingy. Oh fuck, they're hidden in the. Oh shit. Okay, we gotta be. Look really carefully for the dolls. I'm gonna cut the episode here. Oh, it's already 33. Woo! Um, but I really like this. I'm super stoked to play more of this and really dive into the story. And I hope you guys wanna experience this with me or buy it on Steam if you wanna experience for yourself first. Please do that because it's awesome. Um, link is in the description, of course. And I will see you guys tomorrow with more of this. Bye!